almost feels like Twilight Sparkles, like, looks like if she's turned into a freaking thermos. Like, one of those thermo, like, steel, like, bottles for your, for water. Except it makes her, or Pinkie Pie, or Rainbow Dash here look like they've been turned into these, like, steel pig things. I, I don't, I don't know how to comprehend it. This, this is something that's generally terrifying, because this looks like... It's, it's under the name Playful Pony, but with a brush and everything, but look, look at this pony, like, I know the color looks pretty beautiful, but look at the f***ing eyes on this thing, it looks, like, one eye is normal on the face, but then the other eye is on its neck, this is, this is something you'd see in Sodor Fallout, or something like that. The epitome of a freaking knockoff of Nightmare Moon, it just shocked me of how they got the details for the armor pretty well, but the only thing is, Look how far the eye is! Like, jeez! This is something that you'd usually find at a dollar store that doesn't really sell much official stuff, but is known to sell a lot of knockoffs. Like, as you can see, this is a freaking just a knockoff of what well, looks to be a Fluttershy with balloons for a cutie mark. And is that a freaking G3.5 pony? Okay, so even though this one says Fashion Horse, like it said, and it's saying to collect us all. These boys do not look like they're having a good time. In fact, they look they they look generally terrified to the point as if they're gonna get licked, and they're gonna give the person that licked them either lead poisoning or radiation poisoning. I don't know why, but for some reason that Wonderbolt. I don't know why, but it reminds me of Blue Deuce's OC, except he's a Wonderbolt. I don't know why. Yeah, I know these are knockoffs, but I mean. The yellow Mr. Cake and the white nurse Red Heart are the only ones that look legitimately close to the real thing while all the others are just palette swaps. I swear, this reminds me of Super Smash Bros. This is what you get if you combine Dr. Hooves and turn them into, let's say, a f***ing pillow pet. I mean, seriously. Like, it's, it's wild. Like, like, dude, you gotta lay off all the donuts, man. Apparently, the Equestria Girls... Dolls have also had knockoffs. I mean, like, apparently there's a, a Rainbow Dash, Applejack, Luna, for some reason, Fluttershy, and Rarity. I, I don't know what it is about these knockoffs, but they just look a little uncanny. I don't know why, but they look like they're on the slightly on the chunky side. Applejack looks, I mean, Applejack, this one looks pretty okay for a knockoff. Why give her all those accessories if the, if, if the strands of the, the fake main are just gonna fall out when the person plays with it. I mean, seriously. I've seen this at the mall, and I generally don't know what this thing is, but it, I feel like this Twilight looks like she's in excruciating pain. She's got, she's literally got wheels on the other side of her hooves, bicycle handles, like, impaled to the sides of her neck, and it appears to be a freaking, like, like, steps, or ladder steps, that also have like a car pedal for when your kid is like trying to drive them. It, that's gotta be the most painful thing ever. This is a official one, but the thing that kind of creeps me the fuck out about this one is it the way how it moves. It, it, it literally looks like a fucking animatronic for Five Nights at Freddy's. I mean, seriously, it literally, it literally looks like if William Afton invent like watched My Little Pony and decided to make a, a Twilight Sparkle animatronic that looks like this. But it's secretly a killing machine. That's what you get. That's not even a pony. That's a f***ing moose. If that Piggy Pie toy with the moving jaw and eyes lost her bottom jaw, it, it, it's like Percy from Soda or Fallout. I generally don't know why. I mean, it's cute, but it's also cursed at the same time. I mean, looking from this front angle, it 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 looks like if you're looking at a Borzoi dog from the front. That that's gotta be painful. Like. There's no amount of surgery can fix that. Compare that brushable Twilight to the other ponies, along with that little Twilight Sparkle in the box, and that that thing is that thing dwarfs those ponies. And wait a minute, is that freaking pony OC on the box? I don't know why, but it makes her look like a, a fucking shark. I mean, seriously, it looks like a fucking shark. You look at it from the front, it it looks like you're looking at a board's away. This, oh, scratch that. This looks even worse. You know that Pony Life Shining Armor looks like this in Pony Life, but the 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 figurine, those eyebrows, it, 
it literally looks, it literally looks like he's just, he literally looks like he's just a disguise for Cosmo from the Fairly Odd Parents. I mean, seriously. This final scratch here from the Pony Life range that the Shining Armor is from looks pretty good with the glasses on. But that's when you look at the, look at the third picture on the bottom. They did not color her eyes the proper color. Vinyl Scratch's eyes are supposed to be like a rosish pink, not blue. It looks like she's been caught sucking on like a uh, entire lemon or like let's say the sourest candies like a Warhead or a Toxic Waste Warhead's candy. I'm just gonna say this again for like what a third time. It, it, it looks like a fucking Borzoi. It, it looks like a Borzoi dog. What did I say about what would happen if you combined My Little Pony with Sodor Fallout? 